20 people are without jobs tonight after the business they work goes up in flames. It took, what, nearly three hours and some 100 firefighters to put out the fire at Tanner's Timber in Sweetwater. News Channel 9's Kyra Rogers joins us now with more on this story. Kyra, good evening. Kim, Dave, Sandy Todd is one of several workers who watched helplessly as the company burned to the ground. She's worked there for seven years and tonight fears what her job loss will mean for her family. Cold, wet, burned wood is all that's left of Tanner's timber. But just hours ago, it was a sight much different than this. One that Sandy Todd will never forget. It started squalling. Just a disbelief. I just couldn't believe our place, you know, was gone. You know, it's just, it's a heart. It's heartbreaking. Sandy was watching seven years of her life go up in flames. We got on scene, we noticed that it was a fire that was really out of control for one, two districts. Uh, we immediately requested uh, mutual aid. It took 50,000 gallons of water, nearly 100 firefighters, and three hours to put out the blaze. The owner was too upset to talk on camera, but says for now his business is gone. He hopes to find some equipment still salvageable. The loss leaves Sandy wondering what this will mean for her family. Working here for so long and then going out and trying to get another job, it's going to be hard. It really is. You know, I was used to having weekends off, spending with my kids, and, uh, and now uh, things have changed. The cause of the fire is still under investigation. Depend on us to keep you updated as we gather more information. Dave. Kyra Rogers.